Hey, how's it going everybody? Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com. Welcome to the update as we look ahead to Thursday. Play in action in the big dance. Going to be talking about Mount St. Mary's and Texas Southern on this update. We'll get to that first quick note. Uh, you can check out my daily videos in the NBA right here on my YouTube page or check it out over at DocSports.com. My next college basketball video will be on Thursday evening for Friday, but also before you even get to that, on Tuesday afternoon, Doug Upstone and I will be breaking down three first round matchups in the big dance. They'll all be up by Tuesday evening. You'll be able to watch them anytime between Tuesday and tip-off on a Friday and Saturday's game. So be sure to check that out if you wish at DocSports.com. Uh, also wanted to mention that we are red hot in all the main sports as we speak. We just cashed our NHL five-star play on Monday, uh, which means now my plays in the NHL rated five stars or higher are on a run that has produced over $6,100 for those wagering just $100 per unit. Also wanted to mention that uh, my NBA, we had our early game just went final. It cashed. Uh, we still have a game to go, uh, but as we speak, we are 80% on our current NBA run that began before the All-Star break and has continued since they resumed play. Uh, I will have NBA on Tuesday at DocSports.com on my homepage and of course Wednesday and then of course the NHL. Check it out every day. College basketball doesn't get back underway until Wednesday and uh, we are on a run that's up almost $5,000 with my college basketball sides. We've been up all year going back to late November. So check it out daily on my homepage at DocSports.com. All right, let's get to it. It is play in action on Thursday between Mount St. Mary's and Texas Southern. Now, uh, Mount St. Mary's has been getting some of the money. This one opened up Texas Southern as high as two. Uh, now, Mount St. Mary's is laying a point in a couple of books. Most books still have Texas Southern either a one-point favorite or pick them, uh, but we have seen a couple of books move Mount St. Mary's to the short favorite. Now, I'm looking at the total where it opened 134. Uh, totals basically right now between 133 and 134. A lot of 134. 33 and a halfs out there, but still 134s. And I mentioned that highest total in a few books because we are looking to play the under, so be sure to shop around if you want to jump on board. Both of these teams are playing much better basketball than they were early in the season. I mean, Texas Southern has reeled off a ton of wins in a row. Mount St. Mary's four straight games to get into this one, including that upset win over Bryant. Uh, both of these teams, and I'm going to talk about Texas Southern on offense in a minute, but both of these teams play outstanding defensive basketball at their level of competition. And in fact, uh, when you put their ratings, their defensive ratings in with every other uh, team in college basketball, you're looking at two of the top teams in the country, Mount St. Mary's, 24th against the three. They only give up 30% shooting from behind the three-point line. And as far as two-point field goals, they're 31st in the nation. They allow a little over 45.6% shooting. Texas Southern even better on defense inside the arc. They're 23rd in the nation, and they're pretty good defending the three. They give up about 32.32% excuse me, of their opponent's three-pointers. So both of these teams have relied on defense throughout the course of the year, and they play great defensive basketball. Uh, Texas Southern top three in effective field goal percentage on the defensive end. However, having said that, yeah, Texas Southern has picked it up on offense, going after it a little bit more of late. How, the thing is, they don't shoot threes well at all. They're one of the worst teams in all of college basketball shooting the three-pointer. And I just mentioned how Mount St. Mary's really defends well, not just behind the arc, but especially inside that three-point line, 31st in the nation defending the two. So you better be able to hit your threes if you're going to open up the offense against Mount St. Mary's, and Texas Southern does not do that. They are 342nd in the country in shooting three-pointers. I mentioned that great effective field goal percentage defense of Texas Southern. Mount St. Mary's even better, 14th in the country. I think we're going to see an under here, guys. And again, that total, anywhere from 133 to 134, so shop around for the best number if you're going to jump on board. I make my number, by the way, 129. So a little bit of wiggle room between my number and where the total sits as we speak. The free play again for Thursday under between Mount St. Mary's and Texas Southern. If you like the videos, click on that thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. Check out all the videos each and every day of the week. Let's put them in the win column. We'll be right back here Thursday evening with a free video for Friday's Big Dance Action. I'm Scott Spritzer, DocSports.com.